Hmm. I should change this background. Or my TV thing. Let's see what I got in my GIFs folder. Or GIFs. GIFs? GIFs? GIFs. Hmm. Ah. How's this one? It's not a GIF, but. You know. Ooh. Yeah. Nope. It's not a GIF, though. Next. Alright. I think this will do. Yeah. Anyways, lately I've been playing a game. It's kind of like Moemon, but with Angry Birds. Yeah. It's, it's just like it. But, you know. It's a hentai game, so. Mm. First one ever, too. I like it a lot. Maybe because I'm a uh, perverted freak. But I like me, so you should like me too. But anyways, roll the intro! Oh yeah, I don't have any music in my intro. Oh well. What's up guys, this is the game that I was talking about and been playing for the last few days. Uh, Tobe Hime, Tobi, Tobi Hime Interbreed, my bad. Um, it's kind of like Moemon, put together with Angry Birds. Moemon because it's kind of it kind of has like an RPG feel with chicks where you can uh, level up them, level them up and equip uh, shit to them. And Angry Birds because that's how you fight monsters. So yeah, let's get started and check it out. So I can't really read Japanese, but I know that's a shop, and I figured out that says gear and that says units. And in your units, uh, this chick you got. Yeah, you got five main chicks, or human chicks, and, you know, they each have their own stats and their own story that I can't read, and probably uh, sexy or lewd, because I can see the, the word sex right there, but anyways, um, if you don't give them clothes, uh, you see them completely naked, so, you know, that's a plus, but... It's also a plus to put clothes on him because it actually helps in fighting monsters and whatnot. And you know, he has card slots. You can, you can put cards in them. But anyways, to get uh, these other units all the way down here, all these, you know, hence the name, the title, Interbreed, you have to get these chicks to mate with uh, the monsters out there. Yeah. Like on the first stage, or uh, let's see, let's go. All right, so eh, eh, eh. So this slime, it has hearts around it, so that means you know it's kind of frisky and shit. So uh, to essentially clean, uh, what was it? Um, create a slime girl, you would have to mount that thing. But I'm not gonna show it to you because it's on YouTube. So I'm just gonna do my move and kill this motherfucker. Now each every um, each and every character has his own moves and special abilities. So that's pretty cool. They're all different. One has a bow. One has a katana. One has a spear. One has a uh, staff. So like this katana, bang! Just like that. And then after you go twice, then the enemies attack, and then you go again, and so on. He goes back and forth. Yeah. You, you can click in midair to uh, do attacks and shit, so you don't have to just flip on or just flop on wherever you, you landed and actually do some attack while you're going there. And this is how you level up, pretty much. Just keep on fighting those things, and uh, yeah. Now the equipment, equipment, equipment. You get all these different cards, where you know, as attacks, defense, um, crit. I'm not sure what this means. I don't know. I can't read it. I don't know what it does. But yeah, you get there's HP. Um, there's rarity finding items and whatnot. But yeah, I really like this game. It's fun. I don't know why. I really don't. Maybe because there's stuff 
involved that I like. But anyways, it's fun. You should try London. You should try. I know you'll like it. And you sh your girlfriend should probably not see this video too. You got the epic love Thank you. Mm. Hi everyone, hope you enjoyed the video and if you liked it please give a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos every week.